Hi, I'm Fabs, and this video covers changes in the Dawnstar Build 4, which you can play if you're a Captain Forever supporter. This build marks the return of wide sectors, which are massive spaces where you start with a tiny little ship and build up into a high level behemoth. Back when I added wormholes, I also narrowed the sectors, turning them into small spaces where you'd only encounter ships from a section of the power curve. This kind of felt like a road trip, briefly visiting tiny locations, never turning back, and driving ever forward. It really wasn't the game I was trying to make. In a wide sector, you can explore, you can backtrack, you can set up spaces to return to again and again. After a while, a sector kind of feels like home, and that's what I want this game to be about. Later in development, I'll add the wormholes back in, but I'll restrict passage to ships with modules below the destination's lowest level enemies. That way, you can hang out and build ships and play the game wherever you like, in the, like, the common starting zones that have been played and mapped by a million other players, or far off into the distant reaches of the universe. This week, I also added a start screen. It's not final, and I'll work on it more later, but I think it's important that the game starts this way. It's like a common greeting. It says, Hello, I'm a video game. And it's another example of the Dawnstar meeting player expectations where Captain Jameson did not. You can see I also played around with some shadery graphical hackery nonsense here in the form of a wormhole effect. I added this as practice for next week, when I'll finally get to build the super fancy ship rendering tech. I've been researching and planning this for months, so I am stoked that I'll finally get to build it. If you'd like to play the game, you can sign up as a Captain Forever supporter at CaptainForever.com. To keep track of development, you can subscribe to this channel, follow me on Twitter at FarbsMcFarbs, or check out my blog at Farbs.org. See you next week!